Black Cager Sports here at West Catholic, where the Burrs of West Catholic defeated the Saints of Newman Garetti 74 59. A really marquee win for West Catholic. It's been coming, it's been waiting a long time for, for West Catholic to get a win like this. Uh, we're joined by Kasim Watson and Bud Clark. Kareem Watson and Bud Clark. Kareem Watson and Bud Clark. Uh, first, Bud, you had a terrific game tonight. Uh, you seemed to get it going. And just when Newman made a run, Bud, Coach Boca Chica put you back in the game. You had been sitting for a while. You know, what were you seeing out there tonight? How did you feel? And what did you think of you guys' performance tonight? Uh, we played as a team. Whole team was in shots. Uh, we just played as a team. That's what we do. Kasim, Kareem, you and Kasim at one point took turns, and you confused me and and Marcos here on the on the on the on the live stream. You guys really got going in the second half, both of you. You were you had eight straight points in the first half, and then you kind of let Bud and everybody else do their thing. Are you guys just so balanced that you feel like anybody can go off at any time? I mean, I feel like we got. Six, eight, six to eight guys that could go at any time. So uh, when I'm off, he's hitting shots, he's hitting shots. And when I'm on, they're guarding. And when they're they're on, I'm guarding. So I think that's what we just put our head on. We just guard everybody, try to make shots and share the ball. You see? So I know you and your brother, everybody mixes you guys up. And offensively, you guys are obviously very versatile. You can play on the ball, you can shoot the ball. But I think what's you guys, your best ability is the fact that how defensively how versatile you are defensively and how many positions you can play. Because I saw you guys guard the point guard. I saw you guys rebound down. I saw you guys lead the break from the rebounder position. What do you think your best attribute is, you and your brother? Um, I feel like we could do, really do everything. But, like, what we bring best to teams is, like, we could, we could, yeah, we could do everything. I mean, we can guard whoever. Uh, we can score any time. So, I mean, it just, it just makes it easy on our, on our team. And then uh, they just, uh, like, play off of us, really. You know, Philadelphia has seen some twins before. And the Morris brothers, yeah. and I think, I think these Watson brothers remind me a lot of the Morris twins. I really do. They do. Well, Bud, Kasim, Kareem, Black Cater Sports wants to congratulate you guys. Great win tonight. You know, you're now tied for at the top of the league uh, in second place. Wood is obviously still undefeated. You got a big game coming up at their place in a couple weeks. How do you guys feel about your chances to get to the Palestra and then ultimately to cut down the nets? Um, I feel like this is the year, you know, uh, we've been waiting for four years, we've been building for four years, and I think the four years here, that's all we've been talking about. Um, this year, you know, when we seniors and we can lead, and we can really get this thing done this year. So. But I feel like we're going to win the chip, that's all. You know, they, they touched on that, they've seen the battles, they were here the whole four years with Coach Boca Chica, and they've been the catalyst, Coach, they, they're leading their, their team all the way to the top of the Catholic League. I, I agree, think it's their year. I agree. Bud, Watson Twins, Great Kasim, job. Kareem, job, thank you I'm guys. You, All right, congratulations. Play, I'm proud of you, nephew. Black Cajun Sports takes pride in highlighting and showcasing the finest high school players and teams on the East Coast. When the time comes to play big boy basketball, Black Cajun hosts its most competitive events at Charger Nation Sports Complex. While the four regulation high school courts are great, it's the professionalism and quality service that keeps me coming back. I don't have time for the nonsense. I recruit the teams, set the schedules, and then I show up. Charger Nation staff takes care of the referees, scorekeepers, trainers, and most importantly, the security. If you want to run safe and family-friendly basketball events, Charger Nation is definitely the place for you. Charger Nation is located at 375 West Trenton Avenue, Marsville, Pennsylvania, 19067. Call my guy, Billy Everett, today at 215-275-6921. Tell him Black Cajun sent you. Black Cajun Sports is, is joined by West Catholic Prep head coach Miguel Bocachica. Uh, Bo, we talked about it before the game. You know, you thought that you guys had turned the page. You thought you were ready for this game. 
uh, you know, what did you think of your team's performance tonight? I mean, they showed up to play. Um, I think we did a great job on Rob Wright. Obviously, he's a really good player. He was going to get his every now and then. But I think we did a good job of making it tough for him. Uh, outside of a couple catch shot threes, there was not a lot to the rim. Um, and again, like I told you, we want to make sure we guarded our yard, we got back the shooters, and we finished possessions. Um, in the first half, I don't think we finished possessions as well as we thought we could have. Um, but they responded, and we did a lot better in the second half. I'm proud of my guys. You know, it, that, that, tough, that loss this was, was tough. You know, like that was the one that we really wanted. Um, but again, it was a great film session for us. We came in, we learned, and I think, you know, we were put in similar situations this game as last game, and we all handled them better, me included. So um, I'm just happy for my guys. I don't, you know, I just want to get back in there. So, Coach Bogachica, just to touch on what you said about the response from your team, it felt like every time Newman Garetti got it to six or seven, you either had a sub at the table or you made a time, called a timeout, and you had to play ready for your team, and your team has responded every time. Yeah. Is that something that you wanted to make sure that you did this game? Yeah, I, I just think we want to just continue to learn how to win these games. And when you got Roman and Newman back to back, and you know that Roman game again was tough. You learn from it, and then you get to play Newman right away, so you get faced with the same challenges. And again, they were just up for it. Um, I think we have a lot of good basketball players that could just simply play basketball, especially when things break down. And guys made plays. You know, Shamar made shots. Uh, Bud made some timely shots. Zion Stanford was a man. Um, I'm just proud of my guys, man. Like, like this is this is where we want to be. This is what we want to do. And you know, we're here now. So. You know, it's on to the next one. Another great film session after this. And, you know, we'll see O'Hare on Friday. Then it's Bonner. And, you know, it's a gauntlet in this league. So we'll enjoy this for a little bit. And then it's on to the next. Coach Bogachica, congratulations. Thank you. Well-deserved victory. Thank you, thank you. Uh, you guys great earned job, it. Bro. And we wish great you the job. best down the stretch. We'll see great you soon. Great job. Great job. Great job. Coach Kehoe, your thoughts on a great matchup, great Catholic League matchup. I think that just starting with Newman when you have that much time off and then you have no idea who's going to be at practice you have no idea who's going to be allowed to play in the games uh, I, think, I think it's wearing on the staff it's wearing on the players they didn't quit tonight though no. they could have easily quit they didn't quit they just couldn't get their feet under them um, quick turnaround from Monday night and uh, I, I think they'll be good if they can get their whole crew together. Uh, they're going to have some tough battles, and their schedule is not going to be favorable. They're going to play back to back to back to back, and it's going to be tough. Yeah. Uh, West Catholic was tremendous, start to finish. Yeah. Miguel Boca Chica has really grown into his role as the head coach at West Catholic. I, did, I think he did a fabulous job today of managing the clock. I think he did a fabulous job today of managing the subs. I think, he's, I think the Catholic League is going to have their hands full, full with Miguel Boca Chica for the time to come. I, I thought Boke did an unbelievable job, and he grew right before my eyes. I thought there were some things in the Roman game that maybe he could have done differently. Uh, I'm not judging him. I'm just, it's just my perspective as a, as a coach and a former coach. I thought tonight, as you said multiple times on the broadcast, I think Boke pushed all the right buttons tonight, and he had his guys ready. That's the one thing. And I thought his guys were ready for the Roman game. I just thought they just got ahead of themselves a little bit. Did. But they were ready tonight. They were prepared tonight. And Miguel Boca Chica pushed every button he needed to push tonight. You're absolutely right. And, and you know what? He's brought those guys along from freshman, took his lumps, got his butt whooped for the first couple years, and now he's doing the butt whooping. So well, you heard, you heard Bud Clark. He said it's their time. He said it's their time, and the Watson Twins certainly want it because – they're headed out west after this year, so this is their last rodeo. So they got to go get it. Um, I think Coach Barnes I thought it was a great a, game, getting some really good. I players. think both those guys are going to be very good yeah. at Cal State Bakersfield. I think these three juniors are, are really, really good. Bud Clark, Samir Wilbanks, Aki, and Zion Stanford. So West Catholic may not go anywhere for another year. Yeah. They're, they're going to be back again, but we have a long season, and we'll worry about next year. Next year. Uh, Wish both teams the best. Enjoy doing this Absolutely. broadcast so with you. Fun. So much fun. Black Cager Sports, we're going to wrap it up here from West Catholic again. West Catholic Burrs, 74. Newman Garetti Saints, 59. The top of the Catholic League is coming together. We got a lot of one lost teams, and then we have Wood undefeated. Who's our next we'll game? We'll see you coach? guys soon. Our next game will probably be the Wood. Uh, Newman Garetti game at Wood. That's going to be a lot of fun. Looking forward to that one. Coach. Absolutely.
Make sure y'all sign on.